Siamo qui con Yossi Cohen di Ballantine. E innanzitutto grazie per il tempo che ci dedichi. Qual è stato, che cosa hai portato in Ballantine dal, dal tuo arrivo? Uh, let's say I tried to uh, bring to Ballantine a, a new version or, or updating of the brand's value in the aesthetic of what I think can be interesting in the fashion world or in the branding of, uh, of a brand such as Ballantine. So uh, in the beginning I focused to understand uh, in one, one part what was the uh, DNA of the house visually and also the spirit of when it was created and how it was created and why it was created and on the other way just to understand what's uh, the aesthetic of uh, this type of DNA values are representing in Scotland today so um, this type of mix of uh, old and new, it's what was the beginning of my interest of uh, the research of, of the brand, which is still, I'm one year in the brand, so it's, uh, it's still in process. Uh, what was the first thing that influenced me was the uh, combination that I found uh, in Scotland in, in the architecture, in the old building re reconstructed with very modern structure on top, so the, the new combination creates something different, something with uh, a modern approach of aesthetics. Uh, this with combining with what's going on in the communication in the world as uh, Facebook, Twitter, where all our culture mixed, mixed together is becoming or will create something new, a new approach. People are open and are different about their tradition and how they mix with others. So. Let's say this is very, uh, what I call, personal type of uh, inspiration. And what I try to uh, applicate such values into Valentine's was taking the tradition. So for example, for this season, was uh, developing the Shetland and the Tweed uh, uh, spirit, but in pure cashmere instead of in rough and raw materials. Uh, I try to uh, combining tailoring and uh, modern application in using uh, cashmere uh, quoted uh, in order to make our fabric, uh, innovative fabric and personal fabric to uh, make our trench and our outerwear. So this type of combination between tradition, what was uh, Valentine in the past and reinterpreting it in different uh, uh, ways and uh, developing from fabrics to technical as far as workmanship, craftsmanship are the key startup for the brand. Uh, for this season <coughs> the inspiration of the colors were uh, about the nature in one way uh, after a trip in England uh, going between outside and inside. The, the contrast between inside and outside what for me was the nature in uh, the greens and uh, the type of uh, oranges of the leaves and the color of earth on one side and the city colors which for me though the grays the blues more uh, and this type of uh, two inspiration as far as for colors were the startup for the this season uh, uh, presentation for men the collection itself is divided into uh, three labels the one that we are presented here which is the 1921 and the heritage and uh, more sophisticated and more uh, let's say luxury and more fashion if one can say will be presented in Milan on the 14th. Uh, this is in order to create a, a global brand philosophy to our client, the one who is looking for a more traditional but updated product. The heritage is re-edition of historical items that we are looking as a re edition of vintage, but in our philosophy with our research. So, uh, this, uh, this season was about exploration in the Pole Nord and a uh, special theme of uh, English explorer that went uh, in the beginning of the 19th century. And uh, 
the, the travel was the part uh, that is going to be presented in Milan, so I, I won't say anything about it. We'll wait until the 14th before. <laughs>